AI is a threat for our very existence. Garrett, congratulations on the movie. Yeah, thank you. So I'm Simon from um, Odeon Cinemas Group. Can you tell us more about the story? Basically, the world is divided in two. Half the world has banned AI, and half the world has embraced it and got to the point where um, AI is kind of human-like and equals part of society. And, and so there's this war going on, and John David Washington's character essentially can win the war for humanity, and I'll leave it at that. My name is Alfie. You're my friend? How did you strike the balance between the AI needing to feel futuristic, yet close enough to 2023 20, that the audience felt connected to it? Yeah, it's very difficult designing the future because for me, this is really like a retro future. It's just like how I wanted the future to look, how I was promised it would look when I was a kid. So yeah, it's kind of a love letter to that era. Were you inspired by your work on Rogue One when you were working on developing this film? Yeah, a lot of things that were successful on Rogue One. One of them was when we got to go out of the studio and shoot in real locations. I wanted to do a whole movie like that. Like, let's go for every single scene, let's go to the best place in the world. And as a result, I hope, like, the movie, the science fiction of the film, feels really real. What is it about the film that audiences are going to love seeing on the big screen? It has this sort of look from the 1970s and 80s. And so this is, it's this extra wide format. And so you've really got to go and see it on the biggest screen possible. 